What's going on guys? The purpose of this video is to show you a quick and easy way to spot fake vintage cards such as these Gaudi Lou Gehrigs. I found these at an antique store with some 60s hockey cards and I instantly got my hopes up. I tried to do some quick research but the issue is every card has certain nuances that are used to determine if they're fake. This 1933 Gehrig for instance has four signs you can look for such as a small gap between his hat and the border, the bat should cross over into the border, the dirt from the diamond crossing into the left border, and at the bottom the red base should not be perfectly aligned. The problem is this particular card passes all these tests. I decided to spend real money on these cards, but they were nothing but fake. Knowing this one simple test could have saved my money and will hopefully help you not make the same mistake. The card stock they used back then, and even into the 60s and 70s, was much thicker than what they use today. Authentic cards of this vintage will not allow light to pass through. So all you have to do is shine your phone light through a vintage card and see if the light shines through to the other side. For reference, you can see the light does not pass through this 1964 Topps cards that has been authenticated by PSA. Compare that to these other modern cards that allow light straight through exactly like my reprint Gaudi Gehrig's. Thank you for watching. I hope this video helps you avoid any costly mistakes. If it has helped you in any way, please consider helping my channel by liking this video and letting me know in the comments. Happy hunting.